You're watching From the Heart with John Willard. Hi friends, John Willard here. All about cheerfulness today. And remember the subscribe button below for CNA TV. My opening thought. Next time you're feeling sorry for yourself, do something nice for somebody. It will make you feel better. A business consultant tells a story of sitting at breakfast one morning at a lunch counter near the South Station in Boston having arrived on the sleeper train from New York and having been routed out of his berth before seven o'clock. After a poor night's sleep, he was feeling sorry for himself. What you have to accomplish in Boston today is too important to risk failure just because you feel grumpy, he told himself sternly, you better start giving away. But how can you give away sitting on a stool in a row of other grumpy night travelers before seven o'clock in the morning? He said this to himself. When he looked at the salt and pepper, he recalled reading of some woman who said she was sure her husband loved her, but he never thought to pass her the salt and pepper. He had noticed ever since how seldom anyone takes the trouble to pass them. He glanced up and down the counter. The only salt and pepper shakers were in sight right directly in front of him. He had already seasoned his fried eggs with no thought of his fellow diner. Now, Picking up the shakers, he offered them to the man on his right. Perhaps you and some of the other people down the line can use these, he said. He thanked him, seasoned his eggs, and passed the shakers on. Every person at the counter used them. That broke the ice. He got into a conversation with his neighbor and the man next to him joined in. Before he knew it, everyone at the counter was talking and presently they were all laughing and joking. Eating breakfast, seasoned with salt and pepper, and good humor. And he had supplied the seasoning. By the time he had finished his breakfast, he was feeling positively cheerful. His mission in Boston that day had worked out better than he thought possible. My closing thought. There is no market for gloom. You cannot sell it. What the world wants, needs, and will buy is cheer. Many things will catch your eye, but only a few will catch your heart. Pursue those. You can reach me on Twitter at John Willard 47 and I will be speaking at the annual CNA Fest the end of this month 
in Little Rock, Arkansas. Thanks again, friends. This is John Willard from the farm.